trip <laughs> I don't even know why I was tripping the last time you left I feel like I can just live here for the rest of my life like this place is so dope y'all yeah, know it's pretty far from San Mashuno in the spice market huh I still can't believe we really out here doing shit like this I mean it feel like yesterday we was just eating one dollar pizza Walking around the city not having anything to do and now we can just take vacations. Hey guys, it is Kristen aka Coco Games and I am back with another video. This is part two to our last episode of the Brooklyn Way and we back. So as you saw from the beginning of this episode, um you know they're still on vacation, but Tabitha has been blowing Fredo's phone up um he doesn't know why but he's just trying to focus on Brooklyn you know this is supposed to be about him almost like righting his wrongs even though she has no idea that he didn't done some wrongs um and yes yeah, so he's been getting blown up by Tabitha he's been hiding his phone and everything so Brooklyn don't even go near it and he don't know what her problem is, why she needs to talk to him. But he's not trying to focus on that right now. He's trying to focus on Brooklyn because, baby, um, she's going through a lot right now. And no matter what he does, he still loves this girl. So he's trying to make the best of, you know, what she's going through and things like that. So, um, right now, Fredo is alone in the bedroom while Brooklyn is in the living room watching tv but well, he's trying to you know go off to the side because he's gonna go ahead and he's going to text tabitha and sort of send her a, a, a angry text and be like yo like chill out i'm on vacation with you know brooklyn i'm on vacation with my girl you know you need to chill so um he's gonna text her and just tell her like yo like you really need to chill you're not my at the end of the day you're not my girl you're, you're somebody who i do on the side and um you know you just need to chill out so uh he, he he's gonna he's gonna tell her to you know chill out let me see tap the so he need to text her real quick, like, chill out. I'm with my girl right now. We on vacation. I'll talk to you when I get back. So he's just trying to avoid the situation at all costs. While Brooklyn is over here watching TV. Don't 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 look at the doors and windows, child. Okay. I had to update my game and this is what we have. So he just texts her and he's like like this is way too much i feel like he's you know he has other hoes you know he definitely be when he go in the cities he be doing what he do but i feel like tabitha is a little different because like they kind of have a little relationship going on and you already know she's gonna be pissed you know that he's talking to her like this because hello she's a hothead but um obviously she needs to talk to him about something and she just keeps on hitting him up 
Um, but tonight is the night on the town and they're going to be going to dinner tonight. And this is like their last, well, they, they, they have like two more days here um, on Sulani. But, you know, this is like their last full night here. So, um, Fredo has a little dinner planned. He has reservations at a um, restaurant here on the island. So, we're going to go to that later today. Probably like around 8. But, um, yeah, I'm not going to just have them, you know, go throughout the day. And they're going to go to the restaurant later. I already made their little outfits and stuff like that. Oh my god. <laughs> I told y'all. I told y'all Tabitha was going to be annoyed. She said you're very stupid. Look, Fredo just gonna ignore this. He gonna ignore it because he just trying to avoid Brooklyn finding out in any way. Because he knows once Brooklyn finds out, he is done out in these streets so <laughs> he's tried his hardest to just not mess up what he has good at home and he said you see things were just fine here comes the drama Fredo, Fredo doesn't like to be involved in drama like it's just a lot going on for him but he's the one who made this decision to do what he did you know so I think he's gonna go out here um, on this little floaty thing and you know relax before they go and <laughs> go about their day like i feel like he's just like yeah I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go out there for a little bit because he's just he just doesn't get it like but he's the one who did this like so don't feel bad for him he's the one who cheated on brooklyn he's the one who's been double dipping so now it's sort of like, what did you expect to happen? Like, even though he don't know why Tabitha is like on his case, he's the one who did all of this, you know? But, um, yeah, they're going to have a cute night out tonight. It's going to be cute. I don't know why she's watching the freaking weather station, but yeah, um, let's let's uh, uh uh watch a specific channel let's have her watch reality tv okay so she's watching bad girls club um but yeah like i don't feel bad for him at all child like he's the one who did this to himself he's the one who's double dipping but as you see tabitha is over it and when she's over it ain't nobody happy so we'll see what happens child we will see he actually has to go to the bathroom so i'm gonna let him do that um it's so oh i was about to say i don't have a toilet it's so annoying y'all with these doors and stuff the chef then just left stuff everywhere. Oh my god. Let me see. Let me let me get Brooklyn to clean this up. The chef really left things everywhere. Oh my god. This is uh 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 throw away. Throw away. This is too much. Why did she leave everything out like this? Uh uh. You see, you got to do everything yourself in this game. Everything yourself. And this kitchen is so small. I'm going to have to delete it myself. Oh no, throw it away. Thanks, thanks. Look at all of this stuff. Like, did she cook us anything? Oh, they talking, they talking. What are they doing? Oh, she's she's gonna take a nap outside. Okay, she said I'm gonna go relax. I haven't really um used the the tiles like that. Honestly, I I don't really use this pack like that, which is crazy because I like the little series I had going on on the channel with this, but. <laughs> 
honestly, it's not much to do with Sulani. I mean, you can play with the mermaids, but girl. <laughs> yeah, but come on. She trying to get a little tan. She taking a little vacation. Perfect vacation. Do they vacation. Um, I was trying to sing a Jesse Wu song, but I forgot the uh, lyrics. Perfect vacation. Perfect vacation. She's just laid out, honey. Per. I'm happy for Brooklyn. You know, she's been through so much. I think somebody in the comments said that she needs therapy. That's 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 something we're gonna touch on, but she definitely needs therapy. Like, could you imagine like going through what she went through, experiencing that? Like, who who would have you know thought that she was actually there when her brother got killed, you know, like and that's why her tattoo is so important to her, like she has her brother, her sister, her mother, because her family means a lot to her. Obviously, like, she went ahead and made sure her family was good, you know, now that she's dating a rapper. You know, and Fredo, I mean, of course he has his own family who we're gonna meet. But, you know, um, oh my god. I'm so tired of him slipping and falling. Um... But, you know, uh, Brooklyn's mother, like, she was there for him. So, I feel like he feels the same. Oh, can he drink this? Come and drink this. The bartender left that there. You know, so they just doing a little one-two before they go out on the town tonight. Oh, no. From falling down. Fredo could have fell and broke some bones. Anyway. Um, so they're just feeling good. The beach is really relaxing. Solani is really relaxing. And she's taking a little nap. I wonder if she'll get any sun stuff. Oh, they had the massages. Like, they're just feeling really, really good. As they should. I don't know what they watching on TV, child. I need to just change all of the... All the chins. Oh my god, look at how freaking beautiful this is. That's one thing I will say. Like, if it's one thing about Sulani, it's going to give you visuals. It's going to give you the effect. The question is, can we play it? <laughs> it's going to give you the effect. But can we play it is the question. But look, if it's one thing the Sims team did, it's ate these visuals. Okay, so... Brooklyn, get up. Get, 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 get up. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Oh, my God. Are you dumb? <laughs> Bye. I don't have time for this peeping time stuff. So annoying. But anyway, I want Brooklyn to get up. Because she's going to go and shower and get ready for their night out it's gonna be so cute Fredo you ain't got time to be tired just a real romantic night in Sulani I made sure to change her uh her hair to everything braids y'all so it looked like you know it's all consistent oh she's gonna look so cute I like her outfit so, let's just say, you know, Fredo went and got dressed already. Um, yeah, and showered and stuff like that. Um, this is his outfit. He's looking good. He's looking like money. He's looking like money. Then we're going to have Brooklyn come out. They're going to take some pictures together with the little romance mod. It's going to be cute. I don't know why he's freaking watching watching oh I was scared I didn't have my streamer mode in but I do <laughs> I do okay so um Brooklyn Brooklyn come out here thank you thank y'all this is an outfit I gave her but let's not look at it um so this is what she's wearing tonight 
Oh, it's so dark. Y'all need to come out here. Come out here. Both of y'all. Just come out here. Stop watching TV. Just come outside so everybody can see your outfit. <laughs> Look at how freaking cute she looks. Oh my god, it's the windows for me. It's the windows for me. But um, she looks so cute. And I made sure to keep the braids consistent. You know, we on a perfect vacation. So she had to have the braids in. But she looks so cute. I didn't do too much, didn't do too much, but you know, they on a vacation. She looks cute. And um Fredo looks good next to her. So he needs to come out. Yes, look at them looking like a buddy. Ah, they look so good together. Not them looking this good together. Oh my god. Let's try to have them take pictures. They really do look good together. Oh my god. Oh my god, like, what? Uh, where's the Madi? I wonder if this has an update, because Sacrificial did a couple updates. Okay, take romantic selfie. Let's see. Oh my god, of course. Of course. What is this? Nah, nah, nah. Let's have her take it. Let's have her take it. Dang. Always messing up because of height. <laughs> when are we gonna get height? Like, please. Everybody adjust things to height. Take romantic selfie. Oh my god. Not her holding him. I, 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 I can't win. I can't win. I just want a cute, a cute picture. Maybe I should have him take it. A cute picture. Can I have that, huh? Huh? Can I have that? Let me see. Oh, this is okay. This is actually okay. You know, I would prefer it not to be so, like... <laughs> but this is cute. I like this. I like this. Yes! Their little vacation in Sulani. This is everything. Okay. So, <laughs> um, I think we're going, you know, talk a little bit and then they're going to go to the restaurant. Um, let me see. He's going to call her baby girl. Whatever. Oh, he got the Roman skill. I'm going to leave the links down below. <laughs> Everybody have been asking me about like where I get these mods from and stuff the conversation like call them baby girl I'll leave these people's Patreons down below, but these are patreon mods, okay? But it gives you a romance skill so um it says, at level one, Fredo can admit to having little experience or confess never, never woohooed if applicable. Ask for love advice when speaking to friends, create online dating profile, and subsequently browse through online dating profiles. Go on... I didn't even know you could do all this. Fredo will occasionally feel a little tense when spending time with love interests and will generally not perform too well at woohoo. He will improve by using romantic interactions and researching on the computer. Same for Brooklyn. I want to kind of get this up to level two because, babe, what you mean, not not good woohoo? What, 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 what do you mean? Like, what? He been out here slanging. He been out here slanging. Um. 
Let me see. Let's express horny news. <laughs> I wonder if doing regular romance stuff still gets you um, stuff with the romance skill. I wonder. Is she talking about herself, child? I don't know. I just wonder if regular romantic interactions still count as the romance skill. Maybe it does. Let me see. Uh-uh. Romantic interactions and researching on the computer. So I think so. Um, okay, so we're gonna go to the restaurant. Um, yeah, it's gonna be cute. It's gonna be cute. All right, so let's take this to the restaurant. I think he's actually gonna ask her on a date. And um, yeah, we're gonna go to the Solani restaurant that I placed down. All right, so we are at this restaurant. I found this on a gallery. I wish it was a custom, like, beach restaurant, but I couldn't find anything. And, um, also, everything is broken right now, so it's best to just use Maxis. So, this is the restaurant we're going to be at tonight. It has a cute view, um, and they're going to have a cute night together. I made sure to make sure they were going on a date. And I think this is going to be nice for them. So, where is the hosting station? Because I don't... Oh, okay. It's all the way in here. Um, we're going to request a specific table. I want them to be here. So, we're going to request that table. I don't know why Brooklyn's outfit just did that, but ignore it. <laughs> um, oh, not the music jumping off in here. Hopefully, it don't get me copyrighted. So, he's like, I have reservations. And they're going to go to the table outside. I wanted them to be outside. Because, you know, I feel like it's the vibes. The vibes are outside. People starting to filter in, child. All right, I wish they kind of would have set together. Uh, maybe they can. Let's have them sit right here. All right, we're going to have them sit together instead of across from each other on the table. But yes. Ah, look at that. You know the vibes. It looks so good with the little background. Like, this restaurant is kind of eating. But, um, you know, let's have him talk to her. You know, just socialize like they're supposed to. Um, let me see. Um, what can I talk about? Um... Let me see. Share a night on the town spirit. He's going to be like, I'm happy we can go out. Hopefully you like this place. Period. So, um. Oh, let's ask her. Oh, let's ask her what she wants for dinner. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Friendly. Ask what she wants for dinner. Not her saying, huh? <laughs> Did she say that? <laughs> I don't think she answered. Let me ask her again.
Let's ask her what she wants for dinner. If she's saying him, I would, I would die. I would die. Why is she so flirty, child? Yes, Brooklyn. Brooklyn's eating with these braids. I'm sorry. I <laughs> she's eating. And she's definitely giving Sierra with these braids. She didn't even say anything. Uh, not her just being on her phone. This is supposed to be intimate, sweets. She never asked what she answered what she wanted for dinner, so we just go get anything. Um, so we go order after they finish talking. I wish it would have popped up like this is what I want for dinner. Usually it do, but I don't know what happened. He's telling her stories. I not her clapping so hard. All right, let's see what we're gonna get. Um, I feel like I feel like. Wait, I thought they would have something else. Where's the little sex on the beach? <gasps> they don't goody. That's okay. Um, we gonna get Brooklyn a Bridgeport and um. Fredo's gonna get the black and tan. Then what we got up here on the menu? Um, this is a weird, weird menu. Okay. Um, I think that Brooklyn's gonna get the salmon, salmon, whatever you wanna call it. I know people be bit out of shape. Um, and then Fredo's gonna get the steak. Why is the bill zero dollars? Hello? Oh, because it's night on the town. I'm like, why is this zero dollars? It should be more, but it's night on the town. What are they doing? Hello? Oh, I guess they're celebrating. Hello? Is this our waiter? Oh, it is. Well, we can order. We're gonna sit together again, everybody. Yes, yeah, sit down, sit down. Is she pregnant? Is she pregnant? Oh, she's not pregnant. Can we order, please? Can we order, ma'am? Ma'am, can we order our food? Ma'am, with the smudge lipstick. Can we order? Okay, thank you. I guess we, we, we are waiting for our order to be delivered so we can talk now. So, I feel like they're going to get more deeper with their conversation. And I'm going to have Brooklyn talk to him and ask, um, ask if he wants kids. I think they're going to start talking about things, you know, a little bit serious now. Um, because they have been together for a while. And Brooklyn hasn't been, you know, one of those, uh, rapper's girlfriends to get pregnant yet so she's just going to ask him a bunch of stuff um let's compliment his appearance it's her constantly on her phone for me i love kids i want a big family he wants a big family <gasps> Oh, not them going to smash each other. 
This is to be expected. Where are y'all gonna go? This is crazy. Well, um, they definitely did not last long before they they did what they did. Where are they going? Oh, they're going in the bathroom. Uh, of course, of course. So, uh, yeah, they doing what they doing. I'm gonna let them do what they do. <laughs> I'm gonna let them do what they do, babe. Judith is here, so they taking pictures. That's a, that's a jumping little spot. Oh, not her having a headscarf on. <laughs> that's a jumping spot, though. This place jumping, baby. This Salani restaurant ate. Yep, we just gonna let them do what they do. They just gonna do what they do. I don't want their hygiene to decrease. Oh, not them getting all romantic. Not our order coming. Okay, y'all need to, um, y'all need to sit down. Okay, stop this, stop this, stop this. Not Bajorn and freaking Sierra having sex too. <laughs> Baby, this is a lot. This is a lot. Let me, let me, let me get y'all together. All right, so they had to do a little quick one, two, and now they can go and eat their food. It's, it's, it's Bajoran and them in the other bathroom for me. I guess that's just what people doing tonight, huh? So y'all need to go back to y'all table. And get this food. Thank you. So their food came. This is what it's giving. This is what it looks like. Period. Period. Ooh, the salmon is eating. The salmon looks good. Uh, the salmon. Uh, I hate saying words like that. The salmon is eating. Where's Fredo? Fredo, if you don't hurry up, not missing a foot. It's fine. It's fine. Girl, eat your food. Eat your food. Okay, so Fredo's sitting down. Let's have him eat, drink, and they're gonna continue their conversation. Okay, so Fredo was a lot of kids, y'all. I did not expect it. Let's say he gonna say it's hot. I did not expect for him to want like a big family. But he does. Um, they need to have a deep conversation. Let me see if I can find it with all these freaking conversation things. Um, gossip about eggs, please. Um, what can we do? What can we do? What can we do? We want, what are they doing? Oh, they want to take a selfie. Purr, purr, purr. Okay, can y'all sit together again? Thanks. What is wrong, Brooklyn, please? It's a lot going on. Um, can we at least get this first goal out the way on the date? 
Could you imagine them having a bad day after all it is? Y'all do it a lot. Um, let me see. Be enticing. And then he needs to have a deep conversation with her. Maybe he tries to like tell her, but it's hard to, you know, say. Could you imagine him like telling her that he cheated, girl? Um. Okay, let's have them have a deep conversation. All right, we got the first thing out the way. Ooh, why? Why are they not talking? What the heck? Hello? Thank you, girl. Thank you. Thank you for coming to get our stuff. Um. Okay, so. Now they're having a deep conversation. Julia, move! Dang! All in the way. Okay, so they have a little conversation. I think they're talking about, you know, where they want to go in life, where they want to go with their relationship. I think that Fredo is just seeing on this vacation how much Brooklyn really means, you know, to him. And he's like, he don't know why he even attempted to, you know, do what he did with Tabitha in the first place. He's hoping, like, this will just get swept under the rug and they'll never have to talk about it again. Not them taking selfies again! I'ma let them do what they do. Oh, now sit down. Can y'all finish our food, please? Finish, finish your food, please. Thanks. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. All right. All right. All right. Um. Let me see. Let's ask about his sexual past. Just to do it. Um, let me see. They just go ahead and talk, talk, talk. Now, I don't think they can talk about the meal anymore. But that's fine. We got a silver. We should be fine with that. I'm fine with the silver. So they're just talking. Oh, not them being able to propose. Um, we're not gonna do that yet. But I think Fredo is gonna profess his undying love. Because I do feel like, you know, I feel like Fredo loves her. I feel like he's just like I explained in the, the part before the last one, like I feel like he's just adjusting to this new lifestyle where like he's the center of the attention. Everybody wants to be around him. Everybody wants to touch him. Everybody wants to, you know, it's all about him where it definitely was not like that before in his life. So now it's just things are different. And I think he realizes taking this trip and trying to you know chair Brooklyn up before the date of her brother's anniversary um he's seeing that you know this is where I need to be and he really feels like that so he's gonna profess his undying love what's happening what's wrong with her I can't I don't know if he did it or not, but uh, <laughs> we're gonna go back to the villa, and you know, <laughs> you already know what's gonna be going down in the villa. You already know. Um. Oh wait, can we end the meal? Can we not end the meal? Oh, I guess we can't end the meal yet. Let's just end the date. Okay, we got we got a silver silver period. Um 
Dang, I don't think we can in the mill. I mean, I guess we can play for it later, but let's take them back to um, the little place over the bum. So as the night in Sulani wraps up, um, there's something else happening on this side of San Manchuno. Yes, um, I am here at Tabitha's place. Uh, don't worry about this being the same Airbnb from episode two. Just don't worry about it. Um, so <laughs> we are here with Tabitha, and honestly, you guys, um, she has a big decision to make because, <sighs> um, she's pretty sure that these feelings that she's been getting lately is no coincidence and you know it is two in the morning over here she's trying to get in contact with fredo because she's low-key freaking out herself but um she thinks that she's pregnant yes tabitha thinks that she's pregnant so she's just been trying to push it off but she's really scared you know like she's dealt with plenty of ball players plenty of rappers and she hasn't really felt this way about anybody else she's dealt with so of course she was caught slipping she was caught slipping when it came to fredo um and she's cool with brooklyn so it's sort of like girl i was doing your man but i didn't expect to get pregnant by him <sighs> but we don't know yet so we're gonna go and take a pregnancy test because she's been debating this for the last couple days and just has not been wanting to take one. So, um, let's see. I don't really know, y'all. I have a strong feeling she is because how did Fredo be getting in? Like, no, facts, no printer. Like, I don't know, but she's gonna take the pregnancy test and she's really nervous herself um yeah go and get this sweatsuit this on my patreon anyway um <laughs> i think she is y'all i think she is um i haven't even checked brooklyn but i think she is uh because they've been getting it in child this is going to be messy oh Oh my god! Eating for two. Her belly isn't gonna be big because I have the little Miss Sam thing on, but she's pregnant. I. Um, hello? She's pregnant. I mean, okay, so I have the Woohoo Wellness mod. And it adds a bunch of stuff like the fine pregnancy wish. Um which is like seeing if she wanted this pregnancy or not. Um, go to early parenthood class, uh, go to birth class. I just uh, oh my god, y'all, she's pregnant. Her boobs got bigger, huh? So, it's only one thing she really can do. And <laughs> that's text Fredo and tell him that she's pregnant. She's freaking pregnant, y'all. Like, Tabitha, you're supposed to be an OG. What is happening? Uh, this, 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 this is a lot for me. This is, this is a lot. Uh, let's discuss future with Fredo. Uh, we gonna have to text him, like, um, I feel like she's been hitting him up all day, so there's literally only one thing she can do, and that's just tell him straight, flat out what's happening, and that is that she's pregnant. Um... <laughs> my god um yeah um i i i, I hope y'all enjoyed this 
episode of the Brooklyn Way. Um, oh my God, Brooklyn just fell out. <laughs> this episode of the Brooklyn Way. This ain't got nothing to do with me. I hope you enjoy. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see y'all in the next one. Hey, yeah. <laughs> in the next one. <laughs> I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye!